And so we come once more to the turn of another year. It can be a time for reflecting back on the year that's passed or looking ahead to the year that is to come. And no doubt this involves mixed emotions for all of us. The last year has been one of great challenge for us as individuals, communities and nations. And of course there have been times of joy and celebration too. But if we've learnt anything, Surely, it's that we have much less control than we might like to imagine over our lives. For any of us, life can change in the blink of an eye. And it can be hard to know how to respond to this uncertainty. But for Christians, throughout everything, through all the ups and downs, prayer remains a constant, both a comfort and a mystery. Through our intercessions, we bring before God the deepest longings and desires of our heart for ourselves, our communities, for the church and for the world. Through the gift of silence and contemplation, we can journey deeper into our understanding of God and the discovery of what we are each called to do and be. For the faithful, prayer is a duty and a joy but still it can sometimes be hard and none of us always understands the ways of God. To remain constant in prayer requires patience, perseverance and trust. By praying for one another and with one another, we ourselves can be shaped. Through prayer, we recognize our reliance on God, our need of each other and our capacity to be catalysts for change. Christians and all people of goodwill are called to care for the world and for others. And for people of faith, there is no better way to begin than by bringing others before God in prayer, giving thanks with those who rejoice and weeping with those who mourn, and always seeking to transform our prayers into action. May this commitment to one another strengthen us in our relationships so that together we may be a witness to God's love and a force for good in our world.